and welcome to the Fullerton Community Center, where our staff is here today to give you part two of our Still Connecting and Serving updates. We've been here since the beginning of the pandemic in March, providing different programs and services in adapted, new and safe ways for you. And if you have questions about other programs you know we offer, but didn't have a chance to highlight in this video, feel free to give us a call anytime. And in the meantime, let's say hi to the rest of our friendly Parks and Rec staff to learn about those updates and other new programs. Hi, I'm excited to give you an update on our grocery distribution program. It is now every first and third Thursday of the month. This program continues to operate as a drive up service. Through our partnership with Second Harvest Food Bank, we have provided over 6,000 grocery boxes of shelf stable goods since April. We have kickstarted cooking made easy with yours truly. Watch me as I lead you through nutritious and delicious meals you can make at home. So far, over 127 patrons have registered for these cooking classes. Stay tuned for new recipes monthly. Another awesome program that we are excited to continue is Feed Fullerton. It is a CDBG program that provides healthy and delicious meals to Fullerton residents in need. With the help of our community development team, we partner our residents with a number of participating restaurants. Each registered participant receives meal vouchers that can be redeemed at a number of participating restaurants. Since the start of the program, July of 2020, we have provided over 4,500 meals to just under 500 Fullerton households. This year, we are even more excited to serve another 500 households with over 10,000 meals. We're here in the Senior Lounge to give you an update on our popular program, Art at Home, A Course in Creativity. Since its debut in July of 2020, Art at Home has served 2,111 patrons, 1,551 of whom are senior citizens. Every two weeks, seniors come to the Fullerton Community Center and pick up all the supplies and instruction needed to create an original work of art. Everything is free of charge to seniors and all materials are in one prepackaged bag ready for pickup in a contact-free drive-through program. So each Art of Home course has an accompanying video tutorial. It's just like taking an art class that you can do at your own pace. Now this successful program is so much more than just an art kit. Here's one of my favorite Art of Home projects. This is a painting inspired by African-American abstract artist Alma Thomas. And Alma Thomas, here's a fun fact, she didn't even start her career till the age of 75 after having 35 year career in public school teaching. So she had a whole second career at that time. Now, many of our patrons pick up multiple kits to take home and do uh, like have Zoom parties with friends and family and people they haven't seen for a while. You don't have to be a senior to enroll. There is a nominal fee of uh, $9 to get a kit if you're uh, under the age of 60, not just for seniors. So while we're staying connecting and serving, they in turn are staying connected with loved ones through the power of art. Bye. Welcome back to the Fullerton Community Center Grand Hall. Our continued partnership with Meals on Wheels of Orange County has made it possible to provide prepackaged frozen meals to our seniors 60 and over. We have successfully provided 5,300 prepackaged frozen meals since we last adapted our program back in April. Pickup options are available here at the Fullerton Community Center, Monday through Thursday from 11 a.m. to 12.30. Hello, my name is Carla and I'm excited to give you updates on our activity packets and senior wellness call program. These programs started in April as a response to the pandemic, but have become regular parts of our routine. We have stayed connected with about 1,300 seniors in our community with monthly wellness checks and program updates. We have now released eight activity packets, both in English and in Spanish, and they are available to download on our website. These packets include puzzles, games, and resources for food and other essential services. We hope these programs have helped seniors stay entertained at home. Hello. We are working hard to continue helping our older adult community be safe and healthy at home with emergency and fit kits. We have distributed over 800 kits at no cost to Orange County seniors. Kits are distributed on the last Monday of the month. Keep in mind that these starter kits alternate month to month from emergency to fitness related supplies. We are thinking about you and we hope that these starter kits help our community take steps towards staying safe and healthy at home. Hello again. I'm here to talk to you about the Live Local initiative. Live Local is designed to encourage Fullerton residents to shop and support Fullerton businesses. Get ready for two new programs that will help you discover Fullerton and live local. The first is the Fullerton Business Scavenger Hunt. 
The goal is to get Fullerton residents to visit a variety of locations across Fullerton and discover a few gems that they may not have known about. On top of shopping small and helping out local businesses, participants will be entered into a raffle. Prizes will range from gift cards to local businesses to a grand prize value. Excuse me? It's called a teaser. You can't give them all the information now. And remember, small contributions make big impacts on local businesses. What she said. Hi, my name is Leslie Morales and I'm here to update you on Discover Fullerton on Foot. So far we've launched five ongoing guided walks highlighting Fullerton histories, mysteries, and more. Over 350 walkers have registered and joined us on these adventures. Our newest addition to Discover Fullerton, Live Local, that Edgar mentioned earlier, will debut this year and offer guided walks to small businesses around Fullerton. So be on the lookout because this segment is coming soon. Like I said before, get those little sneakies on and discover Fullerton on foot. Hello again. Thanks so much for spending the last few minutes saying hi to our staff and learning about the program updates that we've implemented since the beginning of the pandemic in March. It's been an honor to continue serving you and we look forward to when we get to meet with you again in person.